hello best friend welcome to this video today's we're gonna be talking about the mid gala now before we get into it yeah get into it thank you very much if you're a returning subscriber and for those of you who are just new i don't even know why it took you guys so long to be new we should have been already best friend okay but for those of you who are new make sure to hit that subscribe button make sure it bleeds hit that notification bell so you know what time i post and why not and also give me a thumbs up if you do like this video and then let's talk in the comment down below without further ado let's get into it so what is the migala anyway i'm pretty sure i'm not pronouncing that right but the migala is basically like a event that prestigious like celebrity get to attend every year also and raise money for charity and i think that's really really good and that's what the main focus should be about but to like this year migala was american like i don't know like american just before the Megala even got started, there was already a lot of controversy around it. Mainly it's due to the fact that the Megala invited TikToker to you know to attend the event and most people are not happy about that because they say most people that attend are supposed to be celebrity who like deserve to be there, who earn the spot to be there, like the finish fashionista, and they feel like like people feel like TikToker didn't earn that yet. When people found out that Addison Ray was going to attend, a bunch of TikToker was gonna attend, they specifically target like Addison Ray. I don't know, it's because she's a Trumpy, you know. Maybe because she's a Trumpy, that's what a lot of people came after her, is why didn't they come after like Emberly like Chamberlain? I hope I'm pronouncing her name right but i'm going to like learn okay they did not really bully her as much or bully like few of the tiktokers that attend but for addison Ray, they were just like ksh, 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 ksh. maybe that's the f maybe that's the reason why they did not bully you know dixie de mayo or charlie de mayo but they took a like huge hit on addison ray but because they think oh she's not talented and she's a trumpy i'm not really here to talk about politics because ugh, it get me angry and mad so we're not gonna even go there okay i already told you guys the mid gala you know sparked a lot of controversy because they were like you know inviting tiktoker even though they're not celebrity i don't even know what's a celebrity if you have thousands millions of followers i consider you as a celebrity i don't you guys make the same paid bro whatever check i don't get it but to me they are a celebrity i don't know but i guess like the controversy is that they didn't deserve to be there because they haven't even showcased their talent they just post video online lip syncing like what kind of talent is it like what kind of talent is it and the celebrity actually had to work hard for like their spot to be like celebrity to be called like a celebrity i guess that's what most people like you know iffy about you know now i don't know what was in the water that most people was drinking but my favorite some of my favorite celebrities did not even attend that was so disappointing that was so disappointing but but the mad gala was not half bad it was not half bad but there was a lot of things going on from um, kim kardashian wearing um this apparently hey i'm in the middle of editing right now but are we even sure that's kim kardashian like just because she wore this person wore something that kanye West designed does not mean it's kim kardashian there's so many people that look figured like her do we can anybody comfort her? and can she breathe in that thing like come on now but this kind of upset me a little because it's like people like muslim people been wearing this like look for the past since forever and they they call it an abomination but as soon as a famous person like kim kardashian wears it it's considered a fashion trend like <laughs> come on now one more thing before we begin with the video um i am currently editing by myself and i don't know how to edit i don't know how to add special effect kind of like this i don't know how to edit that 
and I needed somebody to edit like special effect on my videos and I know I'm not like a big youtuber or whatever but I need help but if you're looking for a job it pays okay you know cuz we ain't got that YouTube money yet okay let's grow together but if you're looking for a job to edit it let me know in the comment section please and thank you okay bye now back to the video and from a uh, Hailey Bieber almost crying at the red copper which I think is cool by the way I think is very cool by the way so here's a clip of that <laughs> pause right here okay I'm gonna pause right here now that was very cruel like Selena Gomez fan those were not Selena Gomez fan because Selena Gomez fan would never condone of doing that but at the same time she can't control those are like fake Selena Gomez fan I don't believe they are Selena Gomez fan like what like who does that like regardless of the situation you should always treat another human being like another human being the same way you want to be treated what is so hard in that? I don't understand most people. I do not understand. Why are you gonna make her like half cry like on a special night? I feel like this is her first time coming, I think. But why? Regardless of the situation, I feel like the fans are more like aggressive than usual because their celebrity didn't end up with another celebrity. You're not living the life. You're not them. So you don't know what is happening behind the scene. I don't get why you're mistreating Hailey Bieber like that. Like, t what is the reason? Like, what is the reason? What the reason? What was the reason? I feel really bad for Hailey and I just wanted to give her like a hug, like a virtual hug. And it just, oh, just break my heart that people can do that. Like, what the heck? But, but, Justin Bieber came through. Justin Bieber came through for Haley. He did came through. Okay. But for those people who are just like bullying this person, setting her death threat, don't you have a life? Don't you have a life? I was Team Jelena, but I'm also happy for Haley and Justin Bieber relationship. And Yes, I did love Jelena, but at the same time, we don't know what is happening behind the scene. They've been married for three years now. Come on now, move on. It's time to move on. Why are we still talking about this in 2021? Like, I'm not even sure. Anyway, we're getting sidetracked, okay? So, I had to say about the performance. I really enjoy, like, pretty much all the performance. I was a little bit disappointed of... Okay, don't come at me. Don't come at me. That's just my opinion. Okay, I'm allowed to do that. Okay, I was so disappointed with Olivia Rodrigo's performance of um, "Good for You." Don't get me wrong. I love the song. I love, but when she was performing, I didn't really, you know, have that energy. I didn't really have feel her present being there. I feel like she was nervous or anything like that. All I got from her was just basically. Good for you, I know you're happy and healthy, not me if you ever care to ask. Good for you, I know you... Yeah, that's basically what I heard from her. She was just like walking and singing, walking and singing, walking and singing. Like, even though like some of... I, I, I'm not mad, I'm so proud of my girl Olivia Rodrigo. She performed really good, but you know, it didn't really give me that oomph, but she still performed good. And she won almost every like award, category award. Who was surprised about that? Nobody. But guys, anyway, that's all I have for this video. Make sure to hit that subscribe button where it will hurt. Make a bleed. Hit that notification bell so you know when I'm post. You check up on me and see if I'm still alive. That's how you get to know, okay? That's where you get to know. And make sure to comment down below what you think about this video. And do you like this kind of video? Do you want me to do more? I don't know. It's up to you. And... 
Thank you guys so much for all the support. And I really appreciate it. Bye, guys. Peace. I said peace. Why are you still here? Why are you still here? Oh, my gosh. Best friend, we don't... We really need to practice at, at ending our conversation. Bye. Okay, bye. You first. You first. Okay, fine. Me. Bye.